Right now, our county is on alert as we are preparing for the possibility of oil heading our way. Yeah, this comes as the investigation continues into a pipeline rupture in Orange County. News 8's Chris Groh is live in Oceanside where some tar balls have washed up. Chris, they're still trying to figure out if those tar balls are related, right? Exactly, because there were tar balls found here in Oceanside. Reports of tar balls found in Encinitas, in Del Mar, and other North County beaches. But county is a uh, county, and the, and the health experts are still trying to determine whether or not this is actually from the Orange County oil spill. And we immediately requested the shoreline assessment teams. They were deployed. We should know soon. Uh, and if it is tied back to the to the uh, Orange County spill, which I think is is highly likely, at that point we would declare a state of emergency. Uh, now, as for the county's response in terms of what they are doing again, because they do believe that this could be tied to that Orange County spill. They've already started to deploy boom barriers in bodies of water up in the North County to stop oil and tar balls from spreading. There are also crews in the air flying to get a bird's eye view. They say that they see that sheen on the water, that oil sheen, that slick stuff, still about five miles offshore and north of San Onofre. But again, what we're also paying attention to right now, especially the meteorologists, is the fact that they are seeing a lot of strong winds. And right now, especially, uh, as well as currents and what that could drag that oil down to us, especially in the forecast moving forward in the week. Now, as for if you do see a tar ball, whether or not it's from Orange County, don't touch it. Report it to the lifeguard or whoever uh, their type of first responders may be around you. But if you do come into contact with them, they can be especially harmful for some sensitive individuals. But if you don't have prolonged contact with it, you shouldn't be too worried. But the best thing to do, use soap and water to make sure that you clean whatever area, whatever part of your body, your hands come into contact with those tar balls. Eric and Stella.